Welcome to Easy Physiology and Research Pro. Today we decode the renal gatekeepers. High, low, and no threshold substances. The kidney is not just a filter. It is a smart biochemical gatekeeper. Let's find out who gets the VIP pass, who's on the waiting list, and who gets kicked out at the gate. Flashback to the early 20th century. When renal physiology first got serious, Homer Smith steps in with groundbreaking clearance techniques, revolutionizing how we understand nephron selectivity, and yes, diabetic patients peeing sugar. That gave us the eureka moment. Glucose has a threshold? Boom! Medical physiology upgraded. Think this is just textbook jargon? Think again. Thresholds tell us who's healthy, who's sick, and who's hiding kidney damage. These thresholds expose tubular secrets. Who gets filtered, who gets reabsorbed, and who's just passing through, and the tubular maximum. It's like your kidney's reabsorption limit before it says, that's enough. Glucose, amino acids, phosphate, all high-class molecules, they get filtered and then reabsorbed like royalty. Until the transporters max out, but once that max is hit, they spill into urine. Yes, glucosuria in diabetes is your kidney saying, too much sugar. I give up. Meet urea and uric acid, the undecideds, they get filtered, reabsorbed a little, and dumped out anyway, why? Limited transporter activity, passive diffusion, and a general vibe of, meh, from the nephron. But trust us, when they accumulate, it's serious. Think uremia, think gout. Now for the bouncers list. Inulin, mannitol, paw, filtered? Yes. Reabsorbed? Never. They're shown the exit immediately, and guess what? That's exactly why we love them in physiology. Perfect for measuring GFR and renal plasma flow. They're the reliable lab rats of nephrology. Damaged tubules? Altered thresholds will screen the diagnosis. This is not just academic. It's clinical gold. From drug excretion modeling to renal clearance testing. Threshold dynamics are the foundation of modern nephrology. Every nephrologist's secret weapon? Threshold logic. High means reabsorption until overflow. Low means partial reabsorption. No means excretion, no questions asked. Memorize it. Tattoo it on your hippocampus. This is Kidney Physiology 101, leveled up. And subscribe to Easy Physiology and Research Pro for more physiology hacks.